What's up, everybody? Welcome to what's left of El Jovian, Florida. Uh, catastrophic hurricane damage here. I mean, this is hard to watch. Now, I've done videos here before the hurricane. Um, and let me tell you, this looks nothing like it did before this hurricane. Uh, this is a small little coastal community um, right outside of Port Charlotte. And let me tell you, it is hard to watch. The damage in here is unbelievable. Unbelievable damages uh, here in El Jobin. Let's get in there and explore it. Um, tough, tough, tough to look at. Um, but we have done videos here before the hurricane, so that's good. Uh, maybe we could later on, at some point, we could do a before and after video comparing what it looks like now versus what it looked like uh, before, I guess, would be an idea. But it looks bad. Give me a second. I gotta zoom into the map so I can see where we're going. Um, I was gonna go into some of these streets so you guys can kind of see what's going on here. It looks bad. I mean, it looks destroyed and depleted. Uh, you need commercial buildings. I mean, this looks like just complete destruction. Like, I, I, it's it's not quite as bad as the tornadoes in Kentucky. Like that type of destruction, it's not like that bad, but it's it's definitely bad. So we'll cruise through here and show you guys what it looks like in El Jobin. Um, this place took a hard hit. I mean, we're talking like structural damages everywhere. Unbelievable destruction here in El Jobin. Um, this is just a little place. Probably the news isn't going to cover it because it's not important. You've never heard of it. So why would they cover that, you know? I need you to zoom into the map so I can see where we're at there. Okay. Wow. Okay. This is complete and utter destruction here. And there are a lot of mobile homes here in this area. Wow. This is... Um, Probably the worst destruction we've seen so far since we started doing these videos. All wind damage. I don't think storm surge was an issue here from what I can see. It seems like this is mostly wind damage. Mm -hmm. But this reminds me of the hurricanes and the uh, tornadoes in Kentucky. We actually did cover uh, tornadoes in Kentucky. How um, once cloud got leveled to the ground? Completely gone. I mean, unbelievable. And they're marked the house is safe. They had to write safe, safe. Let the let people know that you know rescue efforts and all that. Mm -hmm. Dude, this is just um I'll zoom in a little bit more on that. Oh it's a dead end, okay. Mm -hmm. So I gotta turn around. Mm -hmm. Wow, this is um difficult to look at. I can't even imagine what the people that live here going to and this is a beautiful place it's kind of isolated mm -hmm. um, it's almost like a perfect retreat from the world really i mean it's isolated it's far you don't have too much cross traffic too much you know it's like the, the type of place where you'd go to if you just want to retire peacefully away from the world you know mm -hmm. um but it's got a long way to go now to recover i mean you're talking uh, this one here is level to the ground all you see is the roof upside down. That's horrible. I mean, all that's left of that mobile home is the roof upside down. That is hard to watch. And we have a lot of people that live up north, and their properties are down here, and they can't really... Um, the news isn't covering these types of places, so I'm going to try to do as much of these kind of off-the-beaten-path places as I can that matter to us, the real Floridians, but may not really matter too much to the news. Um, <sighs> My blood pressure has been really high. I think I just get stressed out seeing... Yeah. 
Like, it's not my property. It's not my problem, really. But, like, it's just, like, you just kind of sympathize with people. Yeah. And you just start kind of feeling bad about it. I can feel my neck throbbing right now. Just from stress. It's not good for my blood pressure. Can you go this part of it? No. The only thing that could have made the situation worse was if they had storm surge on top of it. But it seems like it's more than wind damage. We've been at this gas station before. That Maybe on the way out we can get some water if they're open. Look at the the, the That's wall. That's not wow. even open. Look at the the tower. Really you saw how it like the tower, how it like unbelievable. We could, we've been at this gas station. Before. Look at the tower. Yeah. Get photos of the tower for the other phone for the still photo. Okay. You'll get it on your side. Destruction. Take your photo. No, no, okay. Take a good photo. Zoom in. To take, take the. Oh my gosh! Well, you don't know how to take a photo. How are you gonna be a realtor? You gotta do people's listings. You gonna? How are you gonna take people's photos of their house when you go to a listing like that? It's a photo. Katie, you gotta learn how to take photos if you're gonna be a realtor. I never thought El Jobing would be this bad. I mean, I knew it would be bad, but crap, look at this. You can't even see where some of these structures are starting in anymore. Unbelievable. Okay, first of all, you gotta, the photos got to be pointing out the other way. Warning shots. I think it's kind of ridiculous to do something like that. Yeah. I mean, people are paranoid. They're scared. They're, you know what I mean? Like, but it's a little ridiculous. That's a little bit too much. Nobody's yeah. actually going to go looting. Are you kidding me? Like, for real? A lot of people are probably like, they have to move out. Like, that's what they can say, what they can, you know? I really don't think people are actually going to go looting in a place like this. Like, what type of person would do that, bro? Mm. And they're out there. There's no doubt about it, but. Yeah. There's no doubt about it. There's people out there like that. I just can't imagine. I mean, I couldn't imagine it, but I'm sure there's people out there that are like that. different level of destruction for sure. I thought Lee County had it bad. This is... Wow. Look how much crap just piled up against the winds all through here. I think the real news stories are places like this. But they're not the ones, they're definitely not on the news. You're definitely not going to find this on the news. They're focused on showing you downtown Fort Myers and downtown Naples. Mm -hmm. You know, the tourist. But let's be honest, this is more of a destruction zone than any of that crap. Yeah. But for them, this is not newsworthy. No. This isn't newsworthy. And this is super dangerous. You're on a dead end street. Like, one of these people gets mad at you. And they will tell them what they could do to try to do to you. People are on edge. I bet, like, most of those news reporters mm -hmm. from, like, other states and stuff, they'd be terrified. Like, that sign, no, no warning shots. You know, like, that right there, somebody from another state. Like, you know, they're from yeah. some liberal type of state where they don't have gun laws. They're crazy like Florida. Like somebody from one of those states, if you know, when they see something like that, they'd be like freaked out. Mm -hmm. Or some old person, you know, pretty much, you don't know what the crap you can encounter out here. Yeah. People are super on edge. Mm -hmm. So 
Well, they'd be ter they'd be for one that the people are sending from other states, and they'd be terrified to be out here. Yeah. Like that's not no warning shots, you know. Like that's like, oh my gosh, you know. They're letting you know they're on edge. Okay. What for reason? Understandably. People from other states, like they don't understand the gun laws in these states down here. So like, if they're coming from a different state, just to, like news reporting or something. Like I was talking to some news reporters in California and Oregon and all places. Like they don't have no idea how how it is down here, especially after something like this. Is probably scared to go in the neighborhood. Like, imagine, like, say those stuff. Somebody in a pickup truck gets mad at you for recording. They'll block the road off. Try, who knows what their crap their crap will try to do to you? They're angry. Yeah. They just lost everything they had, and they have no power, no water. They're angry. Like, who knows what those what they'll try to do to you? That's for the fire station the tower. That's Yeah. There you go. No. I might consider giving you a real estate license now. I need a water desperately. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's definitely one of the craziest things I've seen so far. It's like it's just a tangled mess. Hopefully we can get some water here. Yeah. I need a water desperately. There is. It doesn't power. look like there's power. Cash on it? No, there's, there's, there's people in there. I'll be real quick. Yeah. I'll be real quick. I'm just gonna buy water. Okay. I got cash. You gotta have cash after a hurricane. That's one thing you got. You gotta have cash after a hurricane. Yeah. Um, should I keep recording or no? Go ahead.
Oh, you didn't even talk to them while they were waiting? Oh, no. Wow, what a great, uh, what an animator. <laughs> you didn't even talk to them while I was in there? No. I was looking at, I was looking at everything. The dog was cute. Yeah. Wow, I was like, I hope Katie's at least telling them a story, one of her childhood stories. No. <sighs> wow, so you were in there. He was just sitting there quietly in the car with them. That's creepy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, it sucks, man. There's a lot of young people out right now. Like, everybody's young. Around here? Yeah. Somewhat, yeah. Not everybody's elderly. I'm not seeing elderly homes. people. So. All you can see is the roof barely on. That's crazy. Yeah. Uh, I thought we were heading that way, but... There's one more street here. One more street on yeah, Washu. Gonna... Washu. Wash. Oh, you can't even get into this. You can't one. get into it. Working, okay. I guess we're getting on Bravo. Bravo, watch who Bravo one. Watch who Bravo. This place is just unbelievable destruction. It's just hard to even understand how a place can get this much destruction. <laughs> like you're talking, mobile homes just wiped to the ground. Look at that one over there, like to the ground. Mm -hmm. it's just crazy. Yeah. It's bad, man. Like the more you see, the sadder it is. Yeah. Actually, in here, it looks way worse than the other streets. Yeah. Oh, wow, this could have been us in North Naples or, you know, Lehigh. Yeah. I don't think you can go that much further. Yeah. This street was just annihilated. Mm -hmm. Sound effect. Huh? Yeah. And I even get a little sound effect of your phone. Mm -hmm. <sighs> overwhelming. Just overwhelming. I think this is the last street on this side of Aljo, but we gotta hop a little bit further on. <laughs> Dude. Imagine now further down that way towards the beach, I and mean, we still haven't even gotten to the worst of it. It's a Boca Grand. Boca Grand. Uh, we might be able to get on both. We're probably the only other you can get on. Mm -hmm. Where are we going to get enough signal to upload these videos? We just got to do them and figure them out later. Figure it out later? Yeah. It'll take a day to go to Miami, Miami or, something. or something. Yeah. We've over exceeded our travel budget this month for hotels. Oh, yeah. Maybe the hotel in Miami will go down during the weekend. No, it'll go up during the weekend, right? Yeah. Today, what about tomorrow's Friday or Saturday? You want me to check on it? Let's see what the rate is. We might have to do it tonight. Yeah. Even though we have internet, well, we have we have power in mind. I don't know what will make the most if sense. These are, these are kind of important videos. This is super important, yeah. I'm gonna see what it is for tonight. Want a candle? Yeah, I'm checking on it, baby. Let me see, cause signal is signal. Yeah, I guess. It's not an option. How much is it? 197. Oh. And that's one of the cheaper hotels on the other coast. Yes. I think as the, 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 the severity of the situation sets in, yeah. hotels are going to get ridiculously expensive. Yeah. Man, it's even worse than here. 
It's less tomorrow night. Let me see what it is the night after. They said that they, they were going to approve for people that are homeless, they could stay in a hotel. Yeah. So if you're homeless, you can stay in a hotel. So I guess you just drop to the hotel and say, hey, I'm homeless, and they have to let you stay. Mm -hmm. You have to a place where, I don't know how that works, but. <clears throat> let me see how this goes. I feel like the density is okay. Got that name. That's a funny name, El Joe Bean. Ever think about that? El Joe Bean. El Joe Bean. something else so as far as hotels go yeah well we know a few spots where we were able to upload in southwest florida mm -hmm. but with that stupid curfew i don't think we can be back in time to upload today yeah but this is utter destruction here because i have a thought i just don't know if you'd like it or if it would be beneficial i think we already exceed our travel budget already regardless yeah And we'll kind of talk off camera, I think. Where's it at? Oh, towards Orlando? Mm-hmm. The Wi-Fi there isn't all that great. Yeah, that's, that's the, the problem. We stay there, the internet's been... Last time we stayed there, mm -hmm. the internet didn't even do anything, remember? Let me see what I can do. Today, we might have to alternate recording and going someplace. The spot in Fort Myers was pretty good, wasn't it? Yeah. But then, like, it stopped working all of a sudden, right? Like, it was great for, like, a little bit, and then all of a sudden it stopped, right? Yeah. We'll have to try to head back to there. And if that doesn't work, then we'll have to head all the way to East Naples to the other spot we found where there was yeah. no signal. Okay. Possible, I think. Let's see. Yeah, that's definitely possible. But let me see if you approve of it. What's that? We just can't afford it right now. Yeah. We'll try to get it offloaded here in Southwest Florida. We'll figure it out. Yeah. The spot in Fort Myers wasn't too bad. And I can't see this anymore. I'm just. It's stressing me out. Yeah. I think the only thing good is that we did make videos here before the hurricane. Yeah. So there, I think probably our channel is probably one of the only channels that did a drive around this area. Yeah. We actually did drive arounds before the hurricane of this neighborhood. So at least that helps in that, okay. I don't think no other YouTuber did it. I think that there is one historical video, like somebody made a historical video about some cabins that are in the woods or something around here. Mm -hmm. But like the national drive around videos, there aren't too many on the internet about this place. Mm -hmm. um, we could easily get a flat tire here. This is just. Yeah. Should probably get out to the main yeah. road. This is definitely the worst destruction I've seen so far. It's in this, uh, there's literally a pine tree on top of that mountain. Mm -hmm. This is definitely the worst destruction I've seen so far. 
It's like unmatched by anything we've seen in front runners. Yeah. They'll drop the aluminum price down here. But I wonder if it's worth like taking the aluminum like if you're a scrapper like to Georgia or somewhere else where they haven't dropped the prices. Mm -hmm. Why are we even looking at here? It's like, oh, it was a mobile home, but it was jacked up for the storm surge, but I still took it out. Mm -hmm. This is hard to watch, man. If we don't get a flat tire today. Today may be the day we get that flat tire. I can't believe we haven't got it yet. Okay, guys, so that's uh, Eljo Bean. We're going to keep moving forward. Absolutely hard to watch this situation here.